Thank you for visiting our channel. Today I came out to review and also quick unbox this awesome looking headphones. This is called HA1 Wireless Headphones. It's done by a company called Tozo. And I have to mention that this is waterproof, plus this will get charged very quick. And it also, you can wire it to your phone or tablet. And I do not want to forget, if you haven't subscribed to our channel, click the click the subscribe button. Make sure you share this with your friends and family. Make sure you click the notification icon, select all in order to get notified once we have a new video out. On top of that, if you have a question, drop them at the bottom of the video. We love to help you out ASAP. And don't forget to click the click the like button. It really motivates us to make these type of videos quickly with a little more detail every time. In here are all the components that are part of the box. It comes with this user manual. The name is on the top. Also, the model number is right in the bottom. But once you open it, it will tell you what is involved, what part are inside of the box itself, how you will be able to play with this, which we're going to cover in this video. Also, some specifications and some functions, how you will be able to process. And then once you go inside of it, you can also take advantage of the app how it's possible for you to pair, which we're going to cover in this video still. And then going next is how you will be able to process more than one device. Now, that's about it. It also comes with this other little paper. Now, this one is for the quick guide. The name is on the top. The actual model number is in the bottom. Now, when you open it, it gives you about some key functionality, how you will be able to play. And same over here. And there is a Bluetooth pairing, how that's possible. And then once you go to the last page, it tells you about how you will put it back into factory settings and also some LEDs. Now it also comes with this little plastic. I just ripped it open. It comes with two different wires. One is an auxiliary wire, so this way one will go to your headphones and then the other side will go to your phone or devices. And it also comes with a charging wire. One side is USB Type-C to USB Type-A. And this way you can charge it very quickly. And then comes the big moment, which is the headphone itself sitting inside of a little envelope or plastic type. And once you take it out, yes, there's a little part so it doesn't get squished. We're going to take that out too. And this is it. This is how it really looks. Now let's go through and cover a few things. So you can see that the design is really nice. It has some parts that are cut, but you do have huge writing that will tell you right and left. The cushion is really nicely done so that we can put it on your head and it doesn't really hurt your ear. And same thing for the top part is really nicely done. So let's just go around it. Number one will be the left side. There's nothing here but the actual name written. And then this part, you will be able to flip right or left. You can see that. That's about it. And you cannot go more down. There's the hinge or the part that will go on top of you here and the part that you can open so you can fit it on your head. Doesn't matter what size, it doesn't have the actual size anywhere on it, but it's really nicely done. And there are some labeling, which is right around over here, so you can see it, how that part is done really nicely, by the way. And then once you go to the other side, you can do the same thing to open on this side, and the cushion is really nicely done. Now go on to the right-hand side, you have some markings over here too, as you can see. And then once you go to the actual earphone part of it, most of the functions are here, as you can see. But let's just go one by one. So the cushion is, is really nicely done. The name is in the back. And then once you go to it, then you have a power button. You do have a little LED will blink once you turn it on. And then you have the volume up, volume down. Going a little more, you do have the headset jack part so that we can connect it and be wired. The USB type C part so this way you can charge it and then you do have a little part for the mic and then you also have another little button right over here it does have a writing but it's kind of hard to read but you do have it right over here and there's nothing else around it so it's again it's really nicely designed we're going to put it on a little holder so this way we can make the video but it is pretty nice how it's been designed so now we're going to pair the headphones with our phone and let's process that first. So first thing first, we're going to turn it on. So pressing this power button for a couple of seconds. And it will come on. And you can see that, that it is blinking right now. And let's go to our phone. And now for that, we have to go to our phone. From the top, we're going to scroll down. And going into Bluetooth. And the name will show up. So you need to select it. Give it a couple of seconds. And it says to pair, so we will select pair. 
and it's paired. You can see it right now on the list and if we go to this little wheel, it will tell you the name and also it will tell you that it can pick up calls, also play some audio. As usual, also tell you to rename it. You can also disconnect or even unpair if you wish. All right, so in order to play, we have one of our video on YouTube and here's the headphones. So if I have to press the volume, you can see the volume goes up and the volume goes down as we wish. But once you want to click on it, you can see that there is a button. So the one that turned on the actual headphones will be able to pause and play the video. So when I press it, it pauses. And when I press it, it plays. You can see the latency on it is not that much, which is really good. And that's what we really want. But yes, even with the volume, when I press down, you can see the volume going down. Or when I'm pressing it up, it goes up. That means it's working perfectly for us. You see that that's how easy it is to process. So pressing button on this do work. Let's go next and record our voice. Now for this part of the video, there will be a little indentation right around here that will tell you that the voice is not coming from this camera, rather coming from the headphones. So this way you know exactly how it will sound when you're picking up a call or how it will sound on the other side. People can hear you or not. So for that, we're going to start now and Recording now starts, so this is how it really sounds when you are talking on the other side. Now, I haven't played it with the background noise, which I'm going to just play a background noise from a YouTube, and then we're going to test it again to see how good it will sound. But for now, this is how it really sounds when you are playing with this headphones, which is really good right now. It sounds perfect in my mind itself right now. So let's just go next. And this is with the background noise, so I cannot really tell right now how good this will sound. But yes, with the headphones on, I can hear the background noise. And now it's also going to be included inside of this recording itself. So I'm not sure how much it will be canceled, but this is how it really sounds when you do have a background noise with this. This is how good it is. All the links will be available. We can order it from, except that this was our take. I hope you guys like our video. If you do like it, click the click the like button, subscribe button on the top, comment on the bottom. Always remember to visit our own website, which is xetext.info. Like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, Instagram, and other social networking places. And thank you.